Hello guys, we are back again and it is time for the Supernatural Mystery Box. It's <laughs> always so exciting when I get these. Ooh. I have no strength for this today. <laughs> okay, I've obviously just failed at life. No, <laughs> this is not good for me. <laughs> yeah. My manhood has been restored. So we're in after the failed attempt. But here we are. Supernatural mystery box. Da -na 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 -na. Oh, what a surprise. We have a box here. It's a ceramic mug. I bet it's got flowers in it. <laughs> okay, since we kind of know what this is, let's have a look at the mug. Ooh. It's another one in the shape of that type of mug, which is good, because that means that they will kind of match, and I could do with a new mug. I think this is bigger. Ooh. Oh, that's quite cool. Okay, so we have Sam on that side in blue. We've got Dean on that side in red. See, I don't know whether I want him to be the other way around, because I drink with this hand. Which means that Dean is on the front, and I like Dean. Dean's one of my favourite characters. I prefer him a little bit more to Sam, because I can relate to Dean a bit more. So, I like that he's on this side, because I feel like it's just like... Dean. But whenever I drink, I'm going to see Sam. And not Dean. But I don't know if I'd want it the other way, because then it'd be like... Sam on the front, and it doesn't quite work. But even so, this is a good mug. It's a good mug. It'll go with my other mug. Nice mug. It's a very, very nice mug. I'm happy with that. I don't know what I want to do next. It all looks so pretty. Here's a t-shirt, which I will definitely save to the end. Oh, wait, there's socks. Is it socks? Yeah, there's socks. Right, I saw this fluffy bit and I really thought for a minute it was a Christmas hat. Which would be quite cool, actually, but... It's a bit late for Christmas now, because we're in January. Like, nearly February time. Cool. So we have some socks. Oh, they're cool. So they've got Sam and Dean on them as well. And they also have the non-stick stuff. And about, these are cool. These are like slipper socks. Which is good because, like, February is still pretty darn freaking cold. Oh. Who do we have here? It's only Sam. It is about time that we got Sam. So we've had Dean. We've had Cass. We've had Crowley. Now we have got Sam to go with our little plushy collection. Yay! Took you long enough to get here. Oh, cool, we got another hat. So I probably have it a bit like this. Oh, I can turn it out, turn it in, turn it out. No, because there's a label there. Ba -da. But yeah, that is quite a cool hat. It's covered in fluff. That is a cool hat. Oh, what's this? Huh. Well, that's clever. We have a Winchester's charm set, and it's sort of the Winchester logo in half. That's quite cool. Now, a small part of me is thinking that I will have, like, one half, and maybe give Megan the other half, and then it'll be like, oh, my God, when we join, we made these, and it's one of those sort of, like, friendship necklacey, bracelety things, you know, where one has one half, one has the other, but we can do it as a supernatural thing. So that... It's fun. That is quite interesting and cool. We have one of these, which is one of those decal cards and whatnots. And I like that. It's Driver Picks and Music, Shotgun Shots is Cake Hole. And I'm really, really tempted to stick that in my car with a supernatural air freshener, but that is so cool. I might even stick that on like the dashboard where my CDs are and just be like, read the rules. <laughs> That is cool, I like that. That works really well. We've got another we've got another notebook and it's got a holographic front. I don't know if the holograph is gonna work on this screen, but it's the ultimately it's the when Sam and Dean have been I'm gonna say captured, I guess is probably the best word, and they go off to prison so they have their mugshot. So you've got a mugshot of Sam and a mugshot of Dean in a notebook. And that is really quite fun and exciting. So it is a holograph and I can Sort of pick these. Love the holograph sounds. That is a nice ass notebook. 
I mean, that is so good. I mean, it's kind of weird because you have to write this way. I don't think I've ever, in the existence of my notebooks and writings and whatnot, had a notebook that's been this way. But that is so cool. Love it. Now, this is the first time we have ever had a supernatural mystery box that hasn't had one of those posters in it. Which feels weird. This is the first ever time that we've not had a poster to show. So I can't show you. We've got the t-shirt, but I've got no poster to show you. So, I guess we're just going to have to skip that part and go straight to the t-shirt. Uh -huh. So, here we go. Oh, it's long sleeve. That's a nice surprise. Ah, oh, that's cool. What's it say? I can't read. Oh, saving people, hunting things, the family business. That's cool. I like how it's in, I'm going to call it the baseball shirt style, because I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Where it's like the two colours, so the sleeves are the different colours than that. Because I like that style of t-shirt. It's very, very American. And it's, it's nice for a Brit to have something that's American, I guess. But right... So that's cool, and we're going to try this on in three, two, one. Voila. Yeah. It's a three quarter length sleevey shirt, which was a bit unexpected. I don't know how. I kind of like it, and I kind of don't. Because the thing is, every time I have long sleeves, I do roll them up to about here. So this is sort of the normal length, but like, it's weird because they don't quite go up further. It's. It's just an odd sensation, really. I've never sort of handled the three quarter length thing well because it, it's not, it even needs to be up here or down there. I'm not used to this, but it is a nice shirt. It feels comfy. I feel quite cool and nice colors, nice design. And I really, really like this t-shirt. I really like this t-shirt. I think this might be my favorite t-shirt out of all of them. I mean, it's difficult because I like loads of them. I think there was only one that I wasn't really too keen on, and that was the very first one, which was like a Men of Letters jumper. But no, I really like this. This is definitely my favourite T-shirt. This is a good box! Yeah, you know what, I think this is probably my favourite box, mostly because of the T-shirt. The mug is pretty darn cool. Not my favourite mug, though. My favourite mug was from the Castiel box. But, nah. This is good. I'm really happy with this box. I mean, like really, really happy with this box. Anyway, I'm I'm rambling and I'm trying to remember boxes. But ultimately, this is the Supernatural box. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was probably a bit more rambling and waffling than I usually would have liked, but this has been a really fun box. <laughs> if you are interested in getting your own, it's from a company called Culturefly. They do more boxes, like they've got a Game of Thrones one, a Nickelodeon one, I think there's a Pasheen one there as well. And I will leave their information down below. If you would like to see any of my other Supernatural unboxing videos, I will leave a playlist down below as well, so you can click on those. If you've not already seen them, I would suggest watching them. If you have subscribed to my channel and you regularly watch my videos, you've probably noticed that I've joined another brand new subscription to Culturefly as well for the TV show Friends. And I unboxed the first box not long ago, and I will leave that video down below as well. But free for all to comment, like, subscribe, whatever you want to do. And I will see you next time. Bye!